Nico B here with a let's play of Amori. Yes, that's right. We are getting back into an RPG Maker game. God, it feels like it's been ages, doesn't it? But yes, this has been sort of the new, uh, sort of the hot new uh, indie game that's uh, come out fairly recently. Um, and uh, some of you might be surprised, but I actually do know a decent amount about uh, at least the development of this game. Uh, and a lot of that is because I actually know one of the people who was a part of a big part in the creation of this game. Uh, some of you guys uh, might have know her from showing up occasionally on live streams and stuff. Her name is Archaea Nessaya, uh, though I usually refer to her as Nessie. Uh, she's one of my good pals from the RPG Maker days. Uh, and you also might know her as the creator of Princess Princess, which in turn is, means she's also the creator of Naya. That's right that Naya but she had a very large part in the creation of this game she was part of the the team that put uh put this together and this is a very interesting game because this game was supposed to honestly have come out many times and was delayed and delayed and delayed and I believe the the total time that it took for this game to finally get released was was like six years so it was interesting uh when I was seeing people's reactions honestly to this game actually dropping uh on the date that they said it would people were like what the game's here <laughs> but yes and fortunately it does seem like to at least to a lot of people that the wait for this game was in fact worth it because there's been a lot of really positive buzz about it now I have seen some of like the trailers for this game and it's definitely got that that earthboundy vibe that undertale one shot vibe but with a very kind of unique art style of uh kind of this monochrome right uh, i'm not i don't know if the entire game is like just black and white the whole time or if there's gonna be some colored moments actually reminds me a lot of um off actually and it's sort of its art style but from what i've seen of the gameplay the gameplay is very similar to games like earthbound and like undertale that said i don't really know exactly what the game's plot or the story is about which i think i'd sort of prefer I'd rather go in fairly blind but based on the uh, uh, the little disclaimer at the start there, clearly it's not gonna be a happy, fun, go lucky game, which also indicated by this uh, rather stoic looking boy just looking at me with his dead eyes. So I don't know if this game's gonna be going like the the you Nikki, you know, route of like like weird and sporadic horror things, or maybe even more like Undertale where like one side of the story is kind of this nice, happy one. And the other side is like, what the fuck am I doing? And what is happening to me? I don't know. We're going to find out together, though. I knew at some point I wanted to play this game, but I wasn't really sure if I wanted to do it as a let's play and as a live stream. But but seeing as so many of you guys were really uh, requesting it at the uh, end of 13 Sentinels, uh, I thought, you know what? Let's give it a go. Let's give it a try as a, as a let's play. Kind of, let's go back to the year 2012 and <laughs> play through an RPG Maker game again. I think the last RPG Maker game I might have played on as like an actual Let's Play might have been Lisa. Like it's been a while. I'm actually not even sure what engine this uh, this game was made in, but if I had to guess, it probably would be RPG Maker VX or VX Ace. Seeing as this game is six years old, I doubt it's probably the most recent one that came out, which I don't even know what the name of it is it is off the top of my head but uh yeah i do like the uh aesthetic of this already though and honestly you know what it's just it's nice to me when i see like a game that was in a, a long development or maybe even stuck in development hell in some ways actually get released and people are seem to be happy with it that's always just i don't know it's a good feeling to see that because there's a, the worst thing is to see a game get delayed and delayed and delayed and then get released and people are disappointed i.e the cyberpunk syndrome right okay uh i'm actually gonna be doing this on my, my controller um even though, honestly, God, seriously, all the... I'm so used to playing RPG Maker games. Whenever I get in there, I like I get into like RPG Maker mode where I'm like, all right, I know exactly what keys I need to press and what, you know, my control bindings are. But this actually has uh, controller support, so cool. Um, all right, so uh, don't know exactly what to expect with the plot of this, but uh, let's go ahead and find out. Uh, let's get started. Don't worry, be happy. Oh yeah, the other aesthetic of this is like this sort of paper, right? Everything is going to be okay. Like everything's been drawn and handwritten and on this paper texture. No matter what happens. Promise me that we'll always be there for each other.
promise me. Welcome to White Space. Thank you. Hey, don't mind me just hanging out here in my underpants. Living the best life. You've been living here for as long as you can remember. White. Ah, my eyes. I see a long pixel strand. Am I here? Am I moving? I am! Okay. Uh, I don't think I can open a menu. I don't think. You boot up your laptop. Damn, nice, uh, <laughs> nice desktop background there, man. Oh, uh, my desktop background is a uh, brick wall. But uh, the red color was a little too intense. So I had to make a fucking monochrome to stare at screen. <laughs> There's my my trash bin in the in the bottom right. He's got an almost happy face. You stared at the screen. What would you like to? I want to do it again. Yeah. Uh. This is the this is the kind of immersive gameplay I, I look for in my RPG Maker games. <laughs> it's like this is just like real life. Open your journal. Uh. Today I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. Uh, I visited friends. Everything was okay. Visited friends. Visited friends. I spent time on white space. Very, uh, very in-depth uh, schedule I've got here. Cool. <laughs> Thief from the laptop warm warmed your lap. It felt nice. Good. Mr. Katie, what are you doing in this game? <laughs> I know. Now you're look, look, you're even less, less defined than any of the previous games I played. Just a little black blob with two white pixels for each eye. I'm just getting lazy now, Mr. Kid. A Muo. <laughs> Waiting for something to happen? Tissue. Yes, a tissue box for wiping your sorrows away and other things that we won't mention. Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Sure. Oh, that's a good way to start. First page. Uh, well, there's my uh, creepypasta that I've been working on. Uh, apparently, I like black and white and red because it's like blood. Okay, this is my Satan symbol. This is when Mr. Kitty became Lord of all the kitties and rained blood down upon them, which they feasted on. Yummy. And this is the password to get to this point in the game on the left. Uh, more raining blood, a weird bird or something, and a sun. Uh, me drowning my sorrows in a darkness. I have my laptop right, sitting precariously along the edge of it. A uh, snack. Uh, Mr. Kitty floating above the computer. A cake. Probably got blood and giblets inside. I think it's eyeballs on there. Nice. Classic. A uh, baseball bat. A bloody slide. Mr. Uh, Mr. Kitty Butler taking care of me if I, as I'm sick. I I'm seeing some eyes in there. I'm going to see eyeball on the next page. Yeah. Cool. Uh-oh. Something fell nearby. A light bulb hangs from the ceiling wherever wherever it is. <laughs> Look into the light bulb, yes. Ah, uh, it's pitch black inside. Can't see a thing. Interesting. So I'm 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 just spitballing, throwing out here that I have a distinct feeling this is like his quote unquote happy place right in his mind the white space it allows him to turn himself off and just kind of like not think about things too much maybe what are you talking about Nico no it's just it's literally just an empty white void in the vast realm of space okay sorry <laughs> it's a lot more literal than that uh door white door casts a faint shadow what would you like to do absolutely nothing that's what I want to do I'm just gonna stare at it. Mm. Door. Cool. Okay. 
this is good. Uh. Okay, so something fell, huh? Mr. Kennedy, do you know where that what that was? <coughs> Alright, just uh make sure I have my carpet in sight so I can make my way back. Oh, a hand! Ooh! High five. What? Are you bad? Oh, you are bad. Okay, you're you're not the thing that fell, I think. I wanna avoid you. Uh Yeah, it's called, uh, the demons. Oh, God. I chase you for a while. <gasps> Ooh, sweet. A Kara knife. You got a shiny knife. Cool. Now, can I kill these things? No. <gasps> oh, hey, I can pause. Equip. Uh... A shiny new knife. You can see your reflection in the blade. Yes, I can. Ooh, okay. I've got 33 hearts, 20 juice. Mmm. 10 attack, 6 defense, 6 speed, luck. All right, cool. Pocket. Inflict sad on a foe, a friend or a foe. A <laughs> sad poem. I like how the, uh, the portrait actually sort of kind of animates right like a like a rough sketch it's a cool cool effect guard okay uh, <laughs> I see that must be my currency beneath options there what is that my my beautifully depressed coinage uh, this is my stuff whatever who cares what it is life has no meaning isn't that right Mr. Kitty and let me together with you all right you got a knife use it fuck some shit up can I bust out of here now can I stab the door Oh, I can open it. I'm free. Maybe. Okay, I think I'm ready to leave my happy place. With the weird hands. Alright, well that was some more, guys. Hope you all enjoyed Ah! <gasps> Color! Oh, interesting. I'm still black and white, though. Um, Aubrey. We were hoping that you'd come by soon. Wanna play cards with us? We were just about to start another game. Don't talk to me. I'm filled with a fast star that you couldn't possibly copy. Oh, are those Pokemon cards? Oh, whoops. Never mind. Oh, man, what the heck, Aubrey? You messed up all the cards. I was winning, too. Hey there, Kel. There's no need to get so angry. It's just a game, after all. Don't give me that, hero. You only said because you were losing. I can move. Is that an egg? All right, now now we really are in the vast void of space. I can see the stars. Ooh, I got a stuffed toy. Oh, that is the... Oh my God, that sound effect was the most earth y sound effect I've heard since Earthbound. A tentacle is poking out of the ground. Is that what that is? Looks like a little waffle or something. Or a... Slice of grapefruit. Flower. S a single bean on a plate. Is that referencing that freaking... What was that? Was that from Fantasia? With Mickey and Donald and Goofy and they're like fight over a bean on a plate. One of the more depressing Disney cartoons. A photo of someone, f of someone familiar. Toaster. Would you like to make toast? Would I? You made toast. And I didn't even have bread on me. Oh, I was hoping to pick it up. A fluffy pillow shaped like the head of a girl. Cool. <gasps> a gift. A neatly wrapped present. Uh, a blender. A baseball and baseball bat. I like when I step on this, it actually makes a... Is that a cat hole? Cat shaped hole. <laughs> Mr. Kitty fell through the floor and into space. There's a movie on TV. Four boys are walking on railroad tracks. That is freaking, uh, that Stephen King movie, isn't it? Um, God damn it, what movie is it again? So it's actually the one where they found a dead body, right? Hey kids, you wanna see a dead body? No, stand by me, yeah, that's what it is. Stand by me. Yo, Amori, look at what I found the other day. It's a pet rock, isn't he awesome? 
A tiny pet rock stares at you from inside Kill's pocket. I wonder if my guy probably doesn't say anything, does he? I'm gonna name him Hector. <laughs> Hector. What's up, Amori? We've been waiting for you. Kill and Aubrey have been fighting a lot again. You would think they'd get tired of it after a while, but their pills are so full of energy. Why is Kelly so mean to me? You know, the other day, that good for nothing stole my stuffed toy and hid it somewhere in this room. Oh, I just found it. Why would he do something like that? He's so immature. I mean, what did I ever do to him? Oh, I know. Can you find my stuffed toy for me, Amori? Pretty please? I got it. Is that... Could it be? Aubrey, snatch the stuffed toy from you. Hey, Kel, look, it's my stuffed toy. What the heck? Where did you get that? Amori found it. Lucky for me, I've got some real friends. Serves you right. Serves you right, Cal. But you know better than to pick on others. But Aubrey started it. She was the one who was making fun of me for the 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 mole on my... On your... What? Aubrey. Fine. <laughs> on his what? On my wee wee. It's awkward. Oh, that would really suck, actually. Ah, that sounds incredibly uncomfortable. Thank you, Amari. I knew I could count on you. Sure, that's what I'm here for. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and back in my dark dank place. I'll see y'all later. <laughs> Get my darkly voice out for the for Amari. Hey y'all, it's your boy Darkly. I'm here from my black and white world to see what's up. It's a little too bright in here, so I'm I'm gonna head out now. <laughs> All right, bye. <laughs> Can I actually go back? My my friends are waiting. Wait for us. Uh, okay. Cool. Snack. Waiting for something to happen. That's what the cat said to me. Why you guys keep asking me that? Is that cat looking at me? Oh, he fucking is. Mr. Kitty, stop looking at me. I am not Mr. Kitty, I am God Kitty. And you are my servant and shall do my bidding, Amori. Man, whatever, Mr. Kitty. Think I got think you're the boss of me. You think you're all hot shit. I'm Amori, alright? I'm the I'm the next form of Darkly. You thought Darkly was just contained in that one paper Mario game? <laughs> you can't leave without my friends, okay. Here to talk. Man, Aubrey always gets what she wants. Hey, hey Amori, I'm glad I'm glad it's all settled. Those two always seem to bump, be bumping ads. Marie and ba Basil invite us for a picnic at the playground. Did you want to go see them? Yes. All right, everyone. Let's go see let's go see Mari and Basil. My friends are here. We're all level one. Uh, okay. St somehow I knew you'd, be, you'd have your stuffed toys or weapon. Mr. Plant, Mr. Plant Egg makes a weird noise when you punch it. Kel from Keenan and Kel. Uh, rubber ball, child approved. Hector can talk, but is very shy. He is a good friend. Hero, the real protagonist of this story. Spatula, good for flipping burgers. Um, okay, what about the skills? Pep talk makes a friend or foe happy. Okay. So I've got one that makes someone, <laughs> makes someone happy or sad. Gotcha. Annoy makes a friend or foe a anno angry. Uh, cook heals a friend for seventy-five percent of their heart. Can be used outside of a battle. Costs ten. All right, so heroes are healer. Gotcha. Even though he actually has less uh, uh, juice than uh, Kel here. Actually, I just realized everyone's smiling except for my guy. Right? Everyone's happy, not me. Do you want to play cards? That yes. Very much. Go fish, motherfucker! Ugh! Are we? Are we? Are we oh, okay. There we go. <laughs> they had fun. So much fun. Man, y'all suck at this game. We all know Moe is the best of this shit. Just because you cheat him, Mori. Man, it's just because you suck at this game. I don't know. I don't know if I should give him like the darkly voice. The darkly gets a little like, a little seven like. Or if I just, may just give him like a Shuichi voice, kind of a depressed Shuichi voice. I don't know. The Shuichi voice is probably a little more appropriate. The Dark one's funny, but I might get kind of old after a bit. So I think I'll probably, I'll just, I'll just stick with what I was going with. S going out to Mori. S here is your allowance for today. Thank you, Mr. Snake. 
Oh, clams. Is that what that was? Okay. Can I actually go back to the white empty space with, with them? Oh, where are you going, Amori? Let's go, let's go see Ma Mari and Basil. Can't let their picnic go to waste. Okay. Bye. Oh, okay. Now we're just in Earthbound. Or Mother 3. Oh, yeah. Fresh air at last. God, I love that nature. Well, let's go. Where did the girl go? Hey, wait a sec. Poke. Oh, the guys are stuck. Only if you say please. Kill, stop messing around. Get me out of here. Okay, okay, fine. It's because you get a fat ass. Huh. Took you long enough. Well, well, sorry, princess. Well, excuse me, princess. We just live in a tree stump that's got a weird glowing ring on top. Just another day in, a, in another Earthbound game. <laughs> this is all pretty normal, honestly. Okay, we got a few different ways to go here. Did the screen just get a little brighter? I think it did. Oh, yes, I see some parallaxing. Boo, boo, boo. Streetlight. So, we got any encounters? The random encounters in this game? I see enemies on here. Well, we did see uh, those hands earlier. I'm betting those were like encounters, but I, I haven't unlocked the ability to do battle. I haven't learned that I can stab with this sharp ass knife I have. You, you are afraid of spiders. Bitch, I got a knife. Give a shit about that. Okay. Oh, oh, oh my God, I have a run button. I was like, can I move faster? I can move faster. Holy shit. Sorry, it's very unusual to come across a, uh, an RPG maker game with a fucking run button. Which actually, actually normally, I don't even like it. Uh, actually, I am curious. Can you, can you turn on auto run? I don't need it in my instance, but. Uh, you do not seem to be able to now. Usually I don't like that, but it's only when I'm playing on keyboard. If I'm playing a controller, I'm fine with it. Unfortunately, that has that con that control support, so this is good. But yeah, when you're when you're doing the, when you're running with a keyboard, it's kind of awkward. Uh. Ah. Do you want a build a sandcastle with your friend? Yes. Bonding. Ah. Ha. <laughs> okay, he made himself. She made a eggplant or something. I made a rock. That's kind of cute. So just like, you don't talk. We just hang out and play. Oh. Oh, that's a good sign. Hey, how's it going? Here's the, here's the rip where the real Darkly went. Hope y'all enjoyed me showing up as a main character because now I'm the main bad guy. <laughs> ah, you are afraid of drowning. My character sounds like Chucky. I'm, just, I'm afraid. I'm afraid of literally everything. Also, let's be honest. Who's not afraid of drowning? Okay, cool. Death was that way. Good. Uh, I'm afraid of pinwheels. Okay, Amora, you're getting a little ridiculous. Come on. Boo, boo. Uh, oh, is that a fucking Metal Gear ladder? It sure looks that way. Okay, before we go that way, that's probably the way to go. Before we climb to space and reach a giant middle finger. What's over here? Maybe this is a... <gasps> What the hell is that dude with the huge bangs? Oh, this is just a town full of Undertale monsters. Jumping. <laughs> RPG maker jumping. Hey, Basil. Look, it's that black and white kid from before. Oh, hello, Aubrey. Hello, everyone. How are you all doing today? Kills me! Me to me again! Oh, no. Not again. She an adult? I mean, we're all kids, clearly, right? I think she's probably an adult, or at least closer to being one. How could he? Psst, I'm not being mean. 
Aubrey's just being all whiny. She's just this little bitch. Well, Kel, you've just made, made a very convincing point. Now I don't know who to believe. Believe me! No, believe me! <sighs> Settle down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? Chin up, hero. Look at you being all responsible. I really like that about you. He. <laughs> Yeah, come on, Marie. Not now. Oh, Hero, you know I'm just teasing. You're so cute when you get all flustered. I don't know. She's, I think she's clearly older than them. I don't know if she's actually an adult. It's kind of hard to tell because the art style of the game is clearly, you know, everybody has a round head. I don't know. We might come across some actual, like, n people who are... Oh, yes. Right, that person's proportion of that person's head. He is definitely an adult. Uh, while we're waiting for you for you guys, Bates and I were going through this photo album. Or his, his photo album. Did you want to join us? Of course! After all, we're the ones in the pictures, aren't we? Basil, Basil, get a load of this! Look what I can do! <laughs> Does Basil say anything? Come on, Basil, take a picture of me! Look at me! <gasps> oh my god, Demon Chomp! Sorry, Kel. I only take photos of people when they least expect it. You like taking photos of people acting natural when they're not in front of a camera, right, Basil? Oh, wait, uh, you like to take pic- yeah, That was the other guy. You like to take pictures when they're act naturally in front of a camera, right, Basil? Yeah, yeah, there's something special about everyone living their own lives. I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna fuck this up people's voices a lot here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to really pay attention because every character's portrait looks very similar to each other. They're all, I mean, they're all the same kind of color scheme, right? So I gotta, I gotta have to pay really attention who's talking. Those are the moments I wanna capture. So, like, we just have to pretend you're not there? Uh, yeah, I guess you can put it that way. Sure, I can do that. Did you want to show us your photo album now, Basil? Ah, oh, okay. But something amazing. Oh, Basil, stop downing yourself. I'm sure they'll be great. You're right, Aubrey. Sorry. I'll try to believe myself more. Photo. Here. This is all... This way we can all see. I see candy over there. Uh, pictures. Cute. Uh, yeah. She, okay. I think, yeah, she's she's a young girl, too. <laughs> Cute. Give her one a little flower wreath. Uh, is that Hero, then? Like, when his PJs? Watermelon. <laughs> That's how I drink milk, too. I don't put it put the glass to my lips, I just go and pour it down my jugular. I'm the only one not in color. Ew, now stop hugging me. I'm here too, in the back. <laughs> so much watermelon. I'm gonna sleep on your leg. Okay. Happy foot. And that's it. These, these foes are all so charming, Basil. You really know how to capture the moment. Thanks. I didn't take all of them, though. Marie likes to steal my camera sometimes. Only sometimes. Hey, I have an idea. Did you all want to come hang out at my house? I just finished planting some little sprouts and wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. Yeah, sure, it sounds fun. Let's go. It's south of the playground, right? Yep, that's the way. Hmm, I think I'll, I think I'll set this one out. You go on and enjoy yourselves. But if you're feeling, you feeling weary, you can always stop by one of, one of my picnics. I'll always have some refreshments ready. To heal us. You can even eat, save using my picnic basket. Yay! Ah, oh, uh, thanks, Marie. You're always doing so so much for us. Bye, Marie. We'll see you again soon. Run along and have fun now. You know what? Where to find me? Okay. Oh, she's in my party now too. Though not actually, it's not I can control. 
Ah, some nutritious candy. Yes. I feel like new. There's an endless amount of it. Cool. Marie's picnic basket. Mmm, satisfying sound effects. Still the prologue. I'm a swing to the, I'm a swing to the moon. You do that, buddy. Shoot for the stars. No boss zone. Violators will be prosecuted. What? No boss? Like, RPG maker mechanic boss? We're getting super meta in this game? Uh, Burly talks so fast that she's excited. I get, it gets really hard to keep up. Is Van a boy or a girl? I can't tell. Hey, Amori, guess what? I got some plants in a big plant. Just stay put for a while. You'll see what I mean soon enough. Uh, okay. <laughs> Slide. Uh. Wait, just one second. Where do y'all think you're going? You can't leave without joining us for a game of hide and seek. Stay and play with us. Play with us. The more the merrier. You won't play hide and seek again. But you know how this turned out last time. Yeah. Sorry, Burly. I think we're going to have to pass. We're going to Basil's house now. So we'll catch up with you later. Not so fast. You guys trying to avoid me again? What's up with you two? It's it. Is it my face? My rough and tough exterior? At least I'm not as bad as boss. It's a good thing I'm bad. I banned it for the playground after what happened last time. Oh, okay. Gotcha. That's just somebody's name. What if that moron is up to now? Eh, good riddance. So, you want to play hide and seek, Basil? I can go either way. There's no rush to get to my house after all. I think I'll leave it up to Amori. What do you want to do? Me. More, more, my best friend. Come on, you want to play hide and seek, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. What's stopping you then? Come on, let's play. I'll round up everyone. Fine. Ted, huh? All right, Magus, here's the rules. We're gonna be entertaining ourselves a little game of hide and seek. Here are my hands, I got some straw, see? Everyone here is gonna pick a straw. The one with the shortest straw is gonna be it. And we'll have to hide everyone out. Sounds easy enough, all right? Let's be honest, I'm gonna be it. We all got the straws, straws, good. Now I'll see who's gonna be it. Well, 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 looks like the one with the short straw is Amori. Oh, who would have thunk? Me again. Oh wait, Amor Amori, is it? But Amori doesn't like to be alone. Are you gonna be all right, Amori? I can take your place if you want. I don't mind, really. It's fine. Hey, I hear you plotting over there. Straws make, straws make the rules, not me. Come on, I'll be babies. Ain't so bad. We'll be a little bitch. Mori will be fine. Just don't let the darkness creep up on me. When you're ready to play, walk up to the tether ball and close your eyes. And no peeking, or else. All right. Don't worry, Mori. I know you'll be okay. I don't like to be alone unless I'm in my white place. You just, I believe in you. Guess it's bad, buddy. You'll be fine, Amori. Just believe in yourself. Nose ghost. Whatever me and Nose should hide. Oh. Oh wait, his name is. Oh, his name is Nose. These are some great names. I feel sleepy. <laughs> Happy years, Amori. Brows. Ah. Uh? Bangs. Uh, what the hell is that? I don't know where to hide. I'm not creative at all. Hey, Charlene. Hey, it's me, Charlene. I'll try. I'll, I'll try my best. You know. Okay. Five, four, three, two, one. Go. Found you. Well, you found me. What the fuck? What the fuck, Amari? How the hell? You're a cheater. You've got a fucking cheater over here. Mine's a cheater. All right, I'm gonna guess it out. Now I can help you find everyone. Just don't tell Burley about this guy. 
fuck, this is so hard. I don't know where anybody is. I don't see anybody. I don't fucking see anybody, guys. Come on. What the hell you guys see? We're gonna, we're gonna hide too hard. God dang. I think he, I think he did that intentionally, right? Because he knew you didn't like being alone. That's kind of cute. Made it super, right? So he's hiding behind the thing you're literally counting against. Nose ghost, shift you loudly hear us. Nose ghost, button ghost. Happy quiet knows we're hiding, remember? Ah, uh -huh. found you, bunny nose. Nose, they found us. Nose goes. <laughs> oh, you know I can't see mad at you. Oh, nose. Let's go pat play patty cake. Nose, nose. Turns out, there are not many places to hide for a guy my size. Damn it! Why could there not be trees big enough for me? But this is no fun. As long as Burley is happy, I'm happy. <laughs> He's just staying in the open. Darn, he found me. Guess that means I lose. You know what, Happy? What Happy would say right now? She says something like, Bangs, you always try your best at everything. And also, people see how awesome you are. Next time, I guess. Got headphones on my, on my, my severed head. Ah, ah, Charlene! Ah! A suspicious looking, or suspicious blue mailbox. With a welcome mat under it. Eternal banana! Sean and Ren. <laughs> We're not playing! We're exercising! Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Where am I? Uh, the stream that I was on a proud beach surface fan me with palm trees on every side. When suddenly, wait! And now here I am. Must have fallen asleep behind hiding. Guess that game's over for me. Oh, you found me! Darn! Darn! Tootin! Hey, let's go find everyone else some more. La la la! <laughs> Browse over there, just running around the other dude. Ah, ah. Uh, okay, so. Hero is. Oh, wait. Boing! It's me, Happy! You have Happy! So that means I gotta do something else now. Oh, and I'm gonna cut, cut the alphabet backwards. C, Y, X, W, V, U, O, M, uh, O. Every day is a good day for Happy. Bunch of small toy cars. A very difficult puzzle. All the pieces are blank. Jesus. What about these blocks? Building block. Hey, there he is. Oh, hey, hey guys. Uh, you, you know, uh, I found a really good hiding spot, but Sean and Miranda invited uh, me to join them in the exercise routine. It's fun. And good for, good for you. Guys, really should try this. It's really a workout. Oh man, I'm uh, so tired. Wow, you really don't know how to say no to anyone, do you, Hero? Come on, Hero, we gotta find him, help more find everyone else. All right, all right. Well, I'm coming. Bye, Sean. Bye, Ren. This is fun. Yeah, let's do this again sometime. See you later, Hero. Cute. Uh. Whisper, 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 whisper. Probably, sh Probably shouldn't disturb this. Are they like basically making sure I can't leave? Uh, yep, blocking the way out. A yo yo, a tic tac toe toe. Uh, okay, I think it's everybody, isn't it? Oh, I gotta look for glasses. La, la, la. Oh my god, it's the monkey bars! Where's the judge? Where's he at? Play a bit of hide and seek if you're having a hard time, I can lend you a hand. Big sister's always here for you, hey? Oh, okay, I guess you are quote unquote big sis. So, would you like some help? No, I don't need your help. No, no, no. Damn it. I assume that they're all in this area, right? Yeah. Okay, so probably on like one of these trees, right? Figures that the glasses would be the hardest one to find. Oh, wait, wait, no, they're, they're right there. It's a straw on the ground. Pull it out, yes. <laughs> Took you guys long enough. Thought I was gonna suffocate in there. I checked behind the spot. Pretty good, huh? 
looks like you pretty much found everyone else too. You were definitely not there at the start of this either. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I would have seen you the moment I turned around or stepped on you. I expect it, but I like it. A still find a roll call. A la la, a la 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 la. Dad! I'm a fat! Here's the horse, buddy. Charlene! Here. Because! Where have I got? Oh, look at this. Happy! Eh! Bros! Thanks! Here. Fun! But it's here! Ghost! Ghost, ghost! Hero! Present. Kill! Ah, uh, really gotta do this every time, Broly? Hey, how was it called for? Eh! Aubrey! Here I am! Huh? Where's, where's Basil? Oh, that's strange. I thought I, thought I saw him go, go hiding near that tree over there. Basil, where are you? Can you hear us? Basil, you can come out now. You already won. Hello, Basil. Uh-oh. Hey, th there's Basil. Basil, are you okay? Uh, are you stuck? Oh, it's a fucking demon. <laughs> oh, fuck me, it's boss. It's big boss. Boss, I sure knew it was you. You good for the scoundrel? Let Basil go. Yeah, what did Basil ever do to you? Basil's our friend. Don't you dare hurt him. Look who Basil, boss. He didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> you stupid head! You did this about Basil! Don't play dumb! You know why I'm here! How dare you not invite me to hide and seek! I'm the one who showed you all to play in the first place! You're not even playing it right! How can you call it hide and seek without any body slamming? Body slam! My flower crown! Hey! That flower crown we made! That's the flower crown we made for Basil! How could you? Let's let go of him, you bully! No! If I can't play with everyone, then no one can! This is a boss only zone now! Man up! And you're not invited! Oh, here we go! What will Mori and her friends do? They give up and run away. Cool! Neat style. I like it. Fine. Toy? Oh, toy's like item. I, I guess. Or one of the items. Skill. Sad poem. I'm gonna smack you. With, uh, with my knife! Attack. Roll neutral, by the way. Attack, attack. Die! More attacks boss. Hit him right in the... Right in the kisser. <laughs> You weaklings, you call that an attack? Oh, fudge! Damn, boss is uh, built like a fucking brick house. Boss cracks his knuckles. <laughs> hey, that kind of hurt. This isn't fun anymore. Holy shit! Still cracking his knuckles. He's almost dead. Keep killing him. Now you make me angry. It's time for my special move. Body slam! Ow! Ow! Ah! Ah! We all became toast. Amori did not succumb to death. Huh? How are you still moving? Oh, this isn't even my final form, motherfucker! Ah! Still alive, dickhead. Bye. Morris Powers vict party was victorious. Yay, confetti. Yay. Yay. <laughs> Everyone became toast, and uh, Aubrey has a bow on hers. 
32 experience and 22 clams. Oh! This isn't fair! Rematch! I want a rematch! Yeah. <laughs> Roll over, vomiting blood. Blah. Base, are you hurt? Oh, don't worry about me. I'm just fine. Boss, I must hurt to see people have fun without you. But that doesn't mean you can ruin other people's fun. Huh. I know that. <gasps> You're free to join us. There. Does that feel better? Base, are you sure can't do that? Boss is bad news. He's a big mini and he's got a horn on his head. And then another horn on top of that. It's a good thing Omori held on during that final attack or else we would have been all but toast. Literal toast. Mmm. It's okay. I trust him. When we, you were all fighting, he tried really hard to make sure I didn't get hurt. Is that, is that true, boss? Boss. Huh. That's a load of baloney. I don't need to hear these lies. This is my spot. No one is welcome here. <laughs> Bye. Dot, dot, dot. Well, he probably won't be a problem as long as he stays like that. I guess that means we can go to Basil's house now. Sounds good to me. We're leaving now, boss. Don't cause any trouble, okay? Hmm. Shut up. This is my treat. Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Oh, man, you put your head into it. <laughs> oh, that's her yelling it. Or him, or I don't know. Is this guy there? I love puzzles, dude. Yeah, this puzzle, this puzzle rocks. Hello, friends. <laughs> I think Charlene's the shy, creepy one. <laughs> Are they just tired themselves out? Crash really feels pretty nice here. Wanna join us? Yes. Let's all stare at the sky. Stars shine brightly overhead. Is it nighttime or daytime? I don't know. You don't have a care in the world. I see a chair up there. I learned to surf. That's perfect after stargazing. Cool. A learning ability. And also got more experience. You guys didn't get any of it because you were too much of fucking scrubs. I'm guessing it's just like a scan ability. Predict who a foe will target next turn. Oh, cool. So what? Uh, what is this exactly? Yes, hey, yes, yes. Hello, value customer. Welcome to my shop. Please buy something. <laughs> I guess it's probably not the right voice for you. <laughs> I'll let you know I don't appreciate window shoppers. <laughs> yes, yes. Hello, value customer. Welcome to my shop. Please buy something. <laughs> Yeah, something that makes a sounds gotta be a little yeah, I like that. Can't eat a child's favorite food. Sweet. Heals 30 hearts. Juice. Probably better than orange juice. 25 juice. Deals small damage to all foes. Reduce their speed. Jacks. Present. It's not what you wanted. It looks anger on a friend or foe. That's funny. Hop, hop, and hop. Hop, and hop, and hop, and hop. I like Browse. I think he might, might be my favorite character in the game so far. Having fun takes too much effort. So watch my friends having fun is enough for me. Nose, my best, best friend. She can't say much, but she was really smart. Oh, Nose, Nose, the lady, of course. Nose looks very occupied. Nose goes wee. I'm a swing to the moon. You all have picnic with your friends? Yes. Cute. We all have little flower wreaths. Neat. Kel's over there being a little asshole. Actually, I think he's trying to put one together for himself. Cute. Uh, look how cute this game is. I'm just waiting for this shit to start. <laughs> I'm just waiting for somebody to fucking die. Wait, Amari, we're supposed to go to my house. Wait, it's just past the south of the playground. I just finished playing some little sprouts and I wanted to share everyone. Come on, they're really cute. Okay, fine. I want to see where the ladder to fucking heaven went. All right, guys. I think this is probably a good place. Honestly, to end things here for now. I don't like the first episodes of the first series usually being like super long, you know? Just kind of get a little, little taste of it to uh, prepare. But uh, I'm enjoying it so far. It's very cute.
Very cute. I, I imagine it's going to get a lot dark here very shortly. We already did see like a weird goopy figure in like the water, right? But it's, yeah, it's definitely, it's got the, the earth boundy undertale-y one shotty uh, feel about it. That's for certain. With some quirky cast of characters and monsters that are your fat your pals, right? That you definitely want a mercy. Please, mercy. But I hope you all enjoyed this first episode. And if you want to see more of the series, please do leave a like and a favorite. It really does help me out. And subscribe if you're not Rave Gumpy Penguin aboard the SLP, where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy.